Hey guys, this is Ken from Mahalo.com and in this video I'm going to show you all the different ways you can crop your image in iPhoto. iPhoto is an amazing program. Not only to store your photos, but you can edit them too. And let's say I wanted to crop this image. Well, let's look at all the different ways we can do that. Let's hit return and that opens up our edit view. And from there we have lots of different options. One way I can do is Command C. I know it was hard to see, but that opens up my crop. I can drag these corners to crop my image. Now the highlighted area is the area that's going to be in my photo and the dark area that's going to be out. So let's go ahead and hit return and that crops my photo. Now if I don't like this I can go ahead and hit return to previous and we go back to its original size. Now I can hit this crop button right here and it actually gives me more options. I come here, I have plenty of different options. So I can go 4x3, maybe I want to do a standard 5x7 photo, or go ahead and maybe I want to make a poster of this. And speaking of posters, Justin Z is doing an amazing tutorial on making posters. It's just started and I'll go ahead and post a link right here at the end of this video and right now to make sure you can check it out. So even when I'm in my poster view, I can still manipulate or move around the area of the photo. Or if I want a 2x3, that's a great image for an iPhone, and I can use that as a wallpaper. But I don't think I'd ever use a picture of myself as a wallpaper. Now that we're all done, we can hit done, and there it is. So just remember guys, once we're in edit view, we can hit command C, and that opens up our crop tool. One great thing about iPhoto, it always remembers your photo. So let's revert to original, and there we go. Well, guys, this has been Ken from Mahalo.com, and thanks for watching. If you guys have any requests for videos, send them over to request at Mahalo.com.